Did you ever wonder what it means when someone says, the breaker is tripped? This can happen in any home, and it's essential to understand why. Today, we're going to explore the world of your home's electrical panel. A circuit breaker is a vital component that safeguards your electrical circuits. When it detects an overload or issue, it automatically cuts off the power. This not only keeps your electrical equipment safe, but also prevents electrical fires. The electrical panel, also known as a breaker box, is a metal box usually found in a wall. It's the control center for all the electricity in your house. Inside the electrical panel, there are active and passive components. Active components control the flow of electricity and include circuit breakers, contactors, and metering instruments. Passive components don't generate power, but play essential roles like the panel enclosure, mounting rails, terminal blocks, and labels. Inside the panel, wires connect various parts. Hot cables bring electricity from the meter into the panel, while branch circuits protect your devices. There are different types of electrical panels to provide power to homes. Let's explore these. The most common type found in homes, with a main breaker controlling the entire building's power supply. Similar to main breaker panels, but without main breakers. Line wires from the meter connect directly to the lugs in the panel. An additional panel connected to the main breaker panel, useful when you need more circuits or extra power in specific areas. Less common but still found in older buildings, fuse boxes use fuses to protect electrical circuits. A subpanel that connects power from a generator to your main breaker panel, ensuring uninterrupted power during outages. If you're expanding your home, you might need additional circuits. You can add more circuits and circuit breakers to your electrical service panel. Earthing, or grounding, is a safety feature in electrical systems. It prevents electrical shocks and minimizes equipment damage. Different types of earthing systems are used in electrical installations. In the TN system, the neutral point and electrical panel's metal parts are directly connected to the earth. In the TT system, the neutral point is connected to the earth through separate electrodes. In the IT system, the neutral point isn't connected to the earth, and only the electrical panel's metal parts are grounded. We've covered the basics of your home's electrical panel. Remember to prioritize safety and follow local regulations when working with electricity. If you're in need of electrical work, always consider professional help. At Matrix Company Solutions Corp., we take electrical safety seriously. Contact us for a free consultation. And thanks for watching our video. Stay tuned for next part.